YouTube, what it do you, it's your boy Steph. Um, today, I'm gonna talk to you guys about how to seduce women. Um, it's very simple, it's not hard. You just gotta get them to the spot first. All right, so I gotta answer this question this guy asked me, right? So he said, um, me and a girl got uh, intimate one night over FaceTime. The next day I went to her house and said, let's get it in. She was like, nah. Uh, so after the movie, so after watching the movie, I left and I stopped talking to her for two weeks. And now she texts me. Uh, she wants to hang out after a month. We smoked, chilled in her car. She was wearing seductive clothes and playing music. Um, I didn't do anything, but next time I want to get it in with her. So how can I not validate her while showing no emotion but lead it to getting it in? See, you got to get, get rid of this. How can I not validate her? Get that out of your spirit, please, right away. Get that out of your spirit. If the first time she come over or you come over, fellas, and it's it it doesn't lead to something, right? These are one or two things. Maybe you did something wrong or she just wasn't in the mood for that first time. So you did the right thing the first time. No contact. She hit you back. She wanted to hang out again. See, you can't get butt hurt over these things. You can't get hurt over these things of what women do because they going to do it. Now, I'm going to tell you all this. This works 95% of the time. If you can get a woman over, it means she's comfortable with you. And I will tell you this. The number one thing that leads to getting in those guts is a massage and you talking in her ear. Them two things right there, bro. Them two things right there gets all of them going all of them going like when you setting it up or or uh like when you setting up you tell her you know we we give each other massages or she come over from netflix and chill y'all watching a movie and you slowly like say y'all like apart from each other like this but you slowly gradually get closer to her right so say y'all having a conversation y'all having a conversation and you like, yeah, and you just slowly edge up over there, you know what I'm saying? You just get up on there just, just a little bit. You're like, so yeah, so like I did this yesterday and, and you know, we out the way, you chopping it up where but you get closer and y'all still watching the show, but you're not talking to her like this. You talking to her like this in a seductive voice. So you're not talking to her like this. You talking to her like this. Damn, what's going on with you, baby girl? Right? Like while you're looking at her in her eye, Right, and I'm pretty sure you guys should have some sort of lava lamp in your, in your house or some seductive lights, like red lights around your TV. Like you gotta be on top of these things, man. Make sure your room or your house is smelling good. The TV is big enough to see. You know, you can have a 50 inch or 40 inch in there. They not it. They not that expensive anymore. They're like two, three hundred and fifty dollars, right? Invest in yourself. So got the PS4 or the Roku remote to play the Netflix, watch a movie, watch a show. And it goes on from there. How do I know this works? Because I have experience with this. My first time ever doing a Netflix and chill. My first time ever doing a Netflix and chill. It, it started with the massage. My first time ever doing a Netflix and chill. It started with a massage. That's what it led. That's what it started with. We was watching a scary movie. And next thing you know, I just start rubbing on her thigh. Then I stop rubbing on her thigh. Then I start rubbing on her neck. And as I'm rubbing on her neck, I'm talking to her. I'm like, you liking this scary movie? This movie weak. And I'm going lower and lower and lower. And I'm talking to her. Damn, why your body moving like that? You like that, huh? You like when I do that, huh? She, mm-hmm. <laughs> got her. She, mm-hmm. <laughs> got her. It's that easy. You got her. Got her. But you got to know how to be seductive. Like, you can't be no. So, uh, yeah, you like the movie? You a robot. Breath probably smell like Dookie. You a robot. Nah, bro, you got to be smooth with it, man. You got to smell good, man. You got to look good, man. You got to be confident. Because women pick up on that. So, I'm going to tell you something. Women ain't going to make the first move. See, when I, when I came over her house, 
I kind of knew what time it was because she was wearing stuff that was like very revealing. She was wearing stuff that was revealing, but not really that revealing. You know what I'm saying? Like the, the little short shorts and you know, like the little the little uh, house coat thing. You know the little you know the coat thing, right? But I can tell as as um, I'm getting closer to her. I can tell like her energy in her body. So I'm sitting on the sofa and she's sitting like on the left side of me, but on, but like on the floor, but it's like a pillow area on the floor. So I'm on the sofa on top. So I'm up here and she's like, so look, I'm up here. This is me and this is her, right? So when I make my move, I'm just coming closer to her. Then I start rubbing her thigh. Then I start rubbing her neck. When I'm rubbing her neck, I can feel like she's not doing anything. Like she's not doing this or nothing. She's just letting me rub on her neck. I'm like, oh, so I'm getting, so as I'm talking to her, I'm getting, I'm getting by her breasts. <laughs> and she gone. So when you got a chick over, dog, you got to know the right moves to do to seduce her, to take her to the next level. Massages work. Uh-huh. 95% uh, of the time they work. They work. They they I'm telling y'all, they work like a mug. But you gotta have that mouthpiece while you while you while you rubbing her, you gotta be talking to her. Y'all be talking about a subject, but you're talking in your seductive voice about that subject. And then just out of the blue, you alright? You good? And she just loving it. She loving it. Because that's what she want. But she not going to make the first move. If anything, when you get closer to her, she's going to get closer to you. That's the most that she going to do. I'm telling y'all, fellas. I'm telling y'all. This works all the time. But you got to be confident in yourself. See, a lot of y'all not confident in, in, in your skills, man. You, you got to believe in yourself. You got to believe. If I have her over, she going for me. That's how you got to believe. If I got this chick over, she going for me. She want me. That's the mindset you got to have. Because I am promise you, fam, I had that mindset. She wanted me to come over? What? Oh, I already knew what it was. I knew I'm finna get it in. No, I knew I was finna get it in. Then after, when I went lower and lower and lower, guess what? I, guess what? Her, her back, her neck was going back like this. She moaning. Then I get to put my mouth, <laughs> my mouth on them. Then she start to go crazy. It works. And if she doesn't want that the first time, play it off so smooth to the point when you're not mad. Never, ever show a woman that you mad at her. Don't do that. Don't do that. Just play it off, okay? And you do the no contact method. She's going to hit you up. Then when she hits you up, you know, y'all set it up again. Bam, do the same thing again. I guarantee you she's going. She's going to go. She wearing something seductive, man. That means that she... she it's, you can't worry about the, the, the validate, like, you're already in validation mode by being with her. So get that, get rid of, how can I do this without being emotional? You be emotional by not caring about the outcomes of what's going to happen. Right? That's how you not be emotional. Who cares? Right? I'm telling y'all, dog, man. Massages, touching on her, feeling on her, it works. Talking to her seductively, it works. Making her feel good in the moment, it works. Making her feel comfortable, it works. But you have to believe that it works. You can't be timid. You can't be um, uptight and scared to proceed in what it is that you need to do with her. All right, fellas. So my thing is to you, dog. If you if you want to get it in again, if you want to get with her again, let her hit you up and set and make it happen. 
when you do things with women, fellas, you can never move too fast. You always got to do slow. Slow is always greater than too fast with women. I'm telling y'all that right now. When it comes to intimacy and foreplay, slow is killer. Nobody talks seductive fast. You talk seductive slow because you want her to hear your every word. You don't start off going fast. You start off going slow to build that momentum up, to build them watery guts up until you beat it up till she bust bust. Hey, I'm out this thing, y'all, man. Peace.